it was really interesting you saying about your family as being friends, which is interesting, I think, to me. Because you referenced your family and how you interacted with them. And it's really interesting because cause with, uh, with my sister, for instance, we, we have a really deep connection. And I'd also class my, my sister as well as my sibling as my friend, like, re, you know, one of my best friends. In fact, my, my wife is also one of my best friends. But is that a right, re, is that, again, is that something we could, is that, can we put that in the same boat? Can we? Yeah, mm -hmm. I think you can. I yeah. think you can. The, these people that you're, you build relationships with don't just have to be romantic. You have to have shared interests and like people's views and traits and personalities and all these other things. That's no different than being a friend. The only difference to being a friend is that you're not a attracted to them or in love with them i guess would be how i view that yeah i agree i don't know i don't know I about you guys yeah i think if i'm gonna say joe there jose i've got to keep on brand jose i agree 100 percent. i think that for, and for me personally they both fall into that bracket and actually i think again the the older you get the more you start to appreciate that i think you can maybe take it for granted when you're younger yeah or for me obviously everyone realizes things at different paces but that was what would be what I say for my experience. Yeah, and that's the thing, isn't it? I think because I say with my sister, we have a you know, since my mum passed away, we we've really we've you know we we did have a period where we didn't communicate much because we you know it's, it's almost like that bit about the friends, isn't it? Where we connect, you know, we connect, and when we connect, we'd speak for hours, like literally, you know, pick up where we left off. But since my mum passed away, we've been staying in touch a lot, lot more. Yeah, and and actually the, the connections deepened since that, but obviously. It's most likely because of the passing of my mum, I suspect. But I definitely class my sister as a as a dear friend, and my my, my beloved, my wife as as a dear friend. Um, we we like similar things, like Ryan was saying. We like similar things. We like going out to eat, all those sort of things. Of course, we have a little quarrel now and then, even after twenty five years. Um, but it's all like very amicable. We all sort it out, right? But yeah, so I just I just wondering about that. So when I said I've got, if if, if we can class like family as friends, then for me. I've got more than, I've got more than um, five friends. I think more than one. Had they got two, at least two. Um, so yeah, and I suppose that going on the other side, I suppose there can be family who you don't think are your friends. I suppose, I suppose, at that end, isn't there? There's, there, I suppose, yeah, there's people out there where all because they're family, they don't necessarily get on right. And, and I, I think suppose they're not. People will have some like that. There's some people who have lots like that. Some who might have everyone mm. like that. It's, it's different for everyone. So I think if you can class people in that bracket then i think you know i think you're lucky that you've got that connection that exists anyway and then actually you then can foster those relationships off the back of it <laughs>